In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to fix the you are being rate limited issue on Discord. If you've ever found yourself stuck behind this pesky message, don't worry, you're not alone. And there are a few ways to potentially resolve this situation. Before diving into the solutions, let's quickly explain why this happens. Discord uses rate limits to prevent spam and to protect server infrastructure from being overwhelmed. It essentially puts a cap on the number of requests you can make in a short period. If you hit the limit, that's when the message pops up. But fear not, here's what you can do. Sometimes all you really need to do is wait it out. The duration varies, but it could take anywhere from a few hours to 24 hours for the limit to reset. During this time, it might seem tedious, but patience is key. It allows the servers to eventually clear up your request and give you access again. Remember to avoid repeatedly attempting the same action during this period as that might just extend your wait time. Next, consider switching to incognito mode, also known as private browsing, on your web browser. This mode bypasses any cached data that may be interfering with your requests. Open up a new incognito window, sign back into Discord, and see if your issue persists. This can often help because it uses a fresh session without additional data or cookies that might be causing interference. Sometimes, the problem might not be with Discord directly, but with your network. Restarting your router can refresh your network settings and might help lift the rate limit restriction. Simply unplug your router for about 10 seconds, then plug it back in and wait for it to reboot. Once that's done, check Discord again. If that doesn't do the trick, consider switching networks altogether. Try using mobile data if you're on Wi-Fi or vice versa to see if a different connection solves the problem. Finally, if you've tried all these steps and are still encountering the rate limit message, it might be time to contact Discord support. Head over to their support page where you can submit a request for further assistance. When reaching out, try to be as detailed as possible about your issue, specifying what steps you've already taken to try to resolve it. The more information you provide, the easier it will be for the support team to assist you. While running into a rate limit can be annoying, these steps offer a good chance of fixing the problem. Whether it's a wait for a reset, exploring incognito mode, or making adjustments to your network, these actions can often clear the path and get you back to connecting with your friends and community on Discord. Thanks for tuning in, and I hope this guide has been helpful to you.